Welcome back once again, viewers, to another episode of Assassin's Creed Liberation. There we go. HD. I forgot, I forgot about that. <clears throat> On the last episode, we completed about probably New Year's, and it's halfway through the year already. But you know, whatever Keith does, I do. Play. And it's so weird, too. This guy, right there, was supposed to play. Assassin's Creed, Black Flag, <laughs> more than half a year ago. He hasn't even started his playthrough of it yet, and... The pack and, is still in the packaging. Yeah, as well as Assassin's Creed Unity is coming out, too. Has a release date and everything. I don't know what you guys are talking about. Too you bad. Know, by the time he gets to this, we're going to be up to the, the sixth part of Assassin's Creed. <laughs> <laughs> okay, it wouldn't be that much. But it is kind of bullshit on how Unity is only on the next-gen consoles. But I could easily see why. Uh, yeah. It is? Yeah, it's only on the next-gen consoles. Oh, but it, but it's, it's many months away. We can we can get the consoles by then. No, it's only two months away. No, it isn't. It's more than two months. Before I buy for? another console, I'm going to wait till it's on sale. I always do that, wait for a sale. Yeah, yeah. <coughs> but it's, it, I don't, don't, don't get it. Don't get it. Yeah, but it doesn't have to connect with it, so that's why they dropped it. <laughs> so it's not a freaking sale, then. Yeah, they they took out the connect because apparently with the connect on the Xbox and Xbox One, it kind of makes it die out. Wait, is it embedded into the? the yeah, it's in, one? yeah, it's embedded into it. Uh, what? The connect. connect. Like where you do the voice commands and all the other shit. I didn't know it was embedded. Into the Xbox yeah. 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 I thought Nah, that's, that's, that's only for the Xbox 360. And not only slaves like it's a whole different um thing itself. For the Xbox 360. But it's embedded in the Xbox One. You took them off. Yes, he did. Oh, are we supposed to be talking during cutscenes? But they can't, yeah. they don't see the, this is the subtitles, so how the hell are they going to know what when you're ready to go, these guys are saying? Alright, so this will be a completely unknown cutscene. Yeah, they're going to miss out on this cutscene. Unless they find some way to mute our voices. That's, nope. how, that's highly unlikely. Nobody's going to put that much work in it just to see what the, the cutscene was about. <laughs> they can pretty much just buy the game for themselves and see what the cutscene is for themselves. And even then, it was kind of short. Yeah, I don't even know what the hell they were talking about. I don't think it was any important. Well, going on to another important topic, this nigga Joe Hay made me tore my ACL and my meniscus. It wasn't wait, on wait, purpose. Wait, which one? The MCL <laughs> or the ACL? I said ACL. You said ACL meniscus. Yeah, ACL and meniscus. Meniscus is the MCL. No, it isn't. So what's the MCL? The ACL is the ligament. The what's the MCL? The MC what? What's an MCL? That's another ligament nowhere near on the knee. So it's the ACL. The ligament is on your knee. Hey, what's it called? ACL. <laughs> Are you trying to confuse me? <laughs> yes, he is. But the meniscus, hmm. in other words, it was shredded. That's how the doctor said it was. It said was it. Shredded. Yeah, it said I tore my ACL and shredded my meniscus. How the hell did you do that, anyways? I was playing basketball, but nah, I think. Nah, 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 nah. If you went out for a simple layup, you cannot tear up your knee like that. You must have went out for a freaking layup and then you jumped and then jumped. All right, here's here's what I figured happened. Keish was he was being pressured to play basketball by this guy and he didn't really want to play so he decided uh, I mean, what better way to get out of it than to fuck his own knee up. Yeah. Now why would I, I am not that much of a masochist. Anyways, here's how it happened. I was playing a game He's lying in gym like <laughs> like any normal day in gym. And I'm pretty sure that football kinda of fucked up my knees even more because I'm on the line. You know, gotta get down low and squat on your knees and shit. Then shoot back up with your same knees and my knees is already bad to begin with but anyways when I went up for that layup I'm pretty sure I made it but then 
Yeah, you would have went pro if it wasn't for your bum knee. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> Anyways, when I came back down, I kind of felt like it was. What I heard was like a little <laughs> sound, and then I was just on the floor. Next thing I know, it I'm over here on the floor holding my knee. I'm like ah, and I tried to get up, and I was like nope, nope. I won't be able to stand up. Nope. So then so you just wanted a free ride home. <laughs> Did they help you off the field, or did, or no. they just like, ha? Nah. Like, they could roll your ass over there. <laughs> <laughs> nah, the gym teacher um helped me up and put me on the chin, helped me stretch out my leg. It was fun afterwards, but it was really painful. But it doesn't even end there either. New reports of disappearances. Yeah, Are because you now that you have your surgery, you have us to fuck with you till you recover. Actually, surgery for like two years later. This injury happened two years ago, and I get surgery two years later. Because all the doctors were doing... Hey, I know, I, I only recently noticed you started um, talking about your bad knee around the past few months. Perhaps. I feel a He's calling you out. You well, this... <laughs> I just won't let anyone out. <laughs> this happened two years ago. Trust me, it did. So you must have also, like, hurt your knee, knee again, right? Multiple times on multiple occasions, yes. I hurt... Totally had nothing to do. It hurt like a bitch. I was the bad attack was an accident. But here's the thing, though. The real bullshit on why it took so long is because the doctors kept giving me x-rays when I just needed a freaking... What you call it? Surgery? No, 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 no. <laughs> that other shit. With the... He needed surgery right away. No, 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 it's not that. The shit. What was it called? Cat scan? No, that was close. That's close to it. Am I right? No. A CAT scan? Oh. It's a CAT scan. No, it isn't. You <laughs> should <laughs> <laughs> just say a cat scan, but no, it's not that. I forgot what it was called. It's like when they put you like in this round tube shit. That's highly magnetic. MRI. There we go, MRI. I just said that. <laughs> I didn't. You said, I just yeah, said that. Yeah, I think yeah, you did I did. when I said C A T C. Oh well, my bad because I ain't hear you. Because you were hearing C A T scan, which is what you needed instead. No, shut the hell up. Well, anyways, I was getting X rays after X rays after X rays. And they keep saying that there's nothing wrong with my knee. But there clearly is something wrong within the fucking knee, not the bone. So when I finally get the MRI, then they finally figure out like a month or so later, said I had a torn ACL and shredded meniscus. Then uh, then had to plan out surgery like another month later after that. It was a tree, you whore. It's real time consuming. <laughs> Plus, you got to sit in the hospital for like what, five, six hours. Well, I was asleep for most of that time. All right, uh, I should probably tell them how surgery went. Uh, surgery is not good. Surgery is the best. No, it isn't. I never had surgery. So I don't know. Okay. I had surgery. Listen to the master. The I did it to myself, for myself. And nothing good came out of it. Stop Under lying. anesthesia. Stop lying. See, you can't even do that then. <laughs> <laughs> if you put anesthesia on yourself, that means you're fucking sleep surgery. Plus, you can't get the mask off, so you'll probably die. <laughs> Anyways, yesterday, because the surgery happened yesterday, had to go in there at like 10 o'clock in the morning, and I couldn't eat shit after 12 o'clock midnight. But, you know, you should have been asleep by then. Being Rondell, he knew that and decided to exploit his weakness and brought like shit like Chinese food. Yeah. Pizza. He brought 7 Eleven. He's like, hey, 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 you want some? What? You can't? Aww. <laughs> then he gets like a fan, sets it down in front of him, and just holds his food up to the fan so the air is blowing to his face. <laughs> Everything. Putting the air, the, 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 the food behind the fan too. Well, anyways, I couldn't eat anything after midnight from the night before. Had to go in there at 10 o'clock in the morning. Then had to wait man long for other people to go in front of me. And I didn't get called until like 1 o'clock. Like 12 to 1 o'clock. And remember, we came in there like 10 to 11. I hope you brought something to entertain you, like a, like, like a phone or something. 
That he had a new. Microphone. Yeah, I don't have. He doesn't listen to music. Nigga, I went. Queer that I went to sleep. That had the newspaper. I mean, he must have been bored with that newspaper, though. Yeah, considering how long he must have waited there. All right. Well, anyways, we finally got called, and I had to take off all my clothes and put on the gowns. He put on a gown. <laughs> Shut the hell up. Anyways, I had to put two gowns on, one in the front, one in the back. I had to put that like little head thing on to cover my head. And uh, let's see, I had to put my stuff in the locker. They have lockers. I think that was only a high school. I never saw lockers I in high school. I have, well, actually, I did, but it was in the other school. A word. The only luck is I have in my school is in the gym, which is all the way downstairs in the basement. Me too. What does it look like? Rescuing you. Anyways, put my stuff in the locker. Then he was finally able to go to, I believe, not the operating room. Like it was like a waiting area for surgery. So then I was finally ready to go. Put me in a chair, and whoa, they put you in the chair. How are you here? <laughs> not, th not that type of chair. Like it's like it wasn't even a chair. I mean, what the hell am I saying? What the hell am I saying? It was a bed. It was like one of those hospital. They put him in the bed. In the hospital oh, bed. Wow. Damn it! Shut the hell up. Anyways, they put me in the hospital bed. With all the soldiers in town. And then the first thing they did was uncover up my leg and uncover up my arm. Then on my outside hand, they poked me and they missed the vein. They kept moving it. That was me. It, and I, I could agree. I could agree with that. I could have been him. I wasn't going for the vein. You bastard. And then after the first time, I'm over here bleeding out from the outside of my hand. They go turn my hand around for my wrist. And then they had to put a huge ass needle in there. And that did not feel good. But before they put the, the needle in there, they gave me two shots of fucking morphine. Oh, that wasn't morphine I gave you. It was side eyed. Then why am I still alive? You're immune. immune? <laughs> <laughs> cool then. But anyways, they gave me two shots of morphine in my wrist. Then they put a Damn, big ass cool. <laughs> put a big ass needle well, in my hand. Get you then. You're not cool enough for that. Put a big needle in my hand. Oh, yeah, I'm cool enough for that. And then they she put an, it. they put a even bigger True. IV tube in my hand, in my wrist. And you could see that shit pop out. And they started moving. I'm like, oh, what the fuck? So then they finally went down to my leg, put morphine in my leg, like near my knee. Then after that, they transported me to the operating room. Then they put anesthesia on me. Kill him. Love God. And all they said to do was... All the doctor said to do was take deep breaths in and back out. In and back out. While these... Mm, in and out. In and out. Mm. While Rundown Joey said, did they let you count down from 10? Nope. They just said, take deep breaths. I didn't breath. say they let you count down from 10. I didn't even have surgery. Well, Rondo told me, like, they did you have to count down from 10? And was like, no. That's a possibility. Well, anyways, no. They didn't tell me to count down from 10. I, I only just take a deep breath, now gets it into your system, and the knocks you out faster because I've seen you're the mad and black. And they don't want you to count down. But the fort is so big, Bas but let's wrap this story up. After I Keith was under anesthesia... I Mira out there knocked out the surgeons, harvested some organs, <laughs> Why them? stitched them back up with some amateur work, and long story short, he has to go back uh, in about a month. At the end of this month, like the 24th. See? Told you. Yeah, it's pretty much. Now surgery for that lady. Well, anyways, that's not what actually happened. I got, I blacked out. Made five Gs off that. Nice. <laughs> what, the <f> <laughs> what the hell? Anyways, I blacked out after I heard them. After I heard them say, "Take deep breaths in and out like five times," I'm over here waking up. Multiple hours later, I went in the operating room at like two thirty to three o'clock p.m. Next thing, I'm waking up. Look at the clock. It's like eight fifty. Like, uh. Eight fifty. Ass hurts and all that. Yes. Yeah. Yes. He's he's not wrong with the ass hurting. Yeah, I know. I don't know too why. Cause I was sitting on my ass. Oh no, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. That's the reason. Sitting on my ass for multiple hours. I'm waking up. My nothing ass. to do with me and this guy. See, you're putting images in people's heads. Stop doing that. No, I'm not. Yes, you are. 
What? Whoa, where did the food come from? Whoa, what? what? That's the special move that allows you to... Multi-kill, I believe. Yep. Anyways, I woke up. I'm wondering where's dad at. He was nowhere to be found. It was like 9.15 to 9.30. I finally see him come back. I'm like, oh, there he is. How have you been? But then he... A nurse. <laughs> but little did he know it was Rondell in a dress. Uh, <laughs> but uh, he had to say this. He went outside and got himself something to eat. <laughs> While I'm getting a liquid diet. Oh yeah, I told him to get something to eat. Because you was, gone. You was in surgery. I told him. Hmm. It's surgery. Maybe you should, you know, leave. Anyways. Shoot. How do you shoot? How do you shoot? Press shoot. the Y button. Shoot. Press shoot. the Y button. Pop the gun. No, I Tap can't. the trigger. Yo, this guy's blind. It took him a long time to actually detect you. He's like, hmm, maybe that's a rabbit. Like, what? What? What is that? What is that? <laughs> Could be okay. a horse. Anyways, Dad comes back. He had something to eat. I'm over here getting a liquid diet. Then I get something to drink. Warm ass ginger ale. Mm, ah. And well, they gave me like two jello packs. Oh, well, well. Bright side. Well, I enjoy Stop looking Keith's. at things from a negative point of view. I enjoy Keith's little surgery tale. But there's still more to it. And my twist. And John Tiswiss. And we shall continue that story on the next episode of AC Liberation. Probably not. Is this three? What? AC three Liberation? No, it was just... It was just Actually, I think it is a part of... Just call it AC Liberations HD. Because they do meet with Connor.